I'm starting to not to see no good white people no more. <laughs> y'all really lose a hold of y'all kingdom. Yeah. Let's get a pan on them. Let's do the spirit. Let's pan over. Gonna, the curse is gonna switch. Right? Yeah, the, the Deuteronomy is definitely say that the curse yeah. is gonna switch on them. Look at that. Look at that white man, man. Look at the power that he, he no longer have anymore. Look at the kingdom that's coming to an end, man. All praise the most I got Yahweh, man. Bahashem, right. Amashiach, Yahweh Shai. Even though it's down and all the niggas I be hanging with, I can't save you from drowning if we both stuck on the same shit. I don't wanna be no bug, that's all they talk about. I don't wanna be no thug, that's all they talk about. I don't wanna be no hitter, that's all they talk about. Right. It's not gonna be kingdom ships and all that type of shit. It's gonna be Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, Israel, and all you heathens. That's yeah. right in that order. You understand what I'm saying? It's not going to be, oh, this nation has this type of power. This nation has this amount of currency. This right. nation has this, or they have that. No. It's going to be Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, then Israel. That's right. And you guys will have to flow to us according to the book of Isaiah, right. the second chapter. Y'all want to have to come to us for the knowledge, the wisdom of the earth. Y'all not going to be able to govern your lives with the same culture and practices that y'all do now. Y'all right. gonna have to submit yourselves to the laws, statutes, and commandments of the Most High God huh. through the children of Israel. You understand what I'm saying? That's what's coming in this earth. And they're gonna hate us for pushing this truth. They're gonna hate us for his namesake for that specific reason. Right, you hold something? Come on, bring it up. The book of Isaiah, chapter 16 and verse 12. Uh -huh. For the nation and kingdom that will not serve thee Come on. shall perish. The nation and kingdom that won't serve the Lord, when he established that power in the earth, shall what? Shall perish. Shall perish. So if you don't want to serve the gods of this earth, who you were meant to serve anyway, come on, put your hand, your head between your legs and kiss your ass goodbye. Plain and simple. Because you're dealing with a force that you don't comprehend, man. We're dealing with the creator of everything you see. God. We're dealing with the creator of everything you see with your, with your eyes. Anything you can see with your opticals, you're seeing the creation of the Father. He's the power and driving force of Israel. Israel will be that teaching, that teaching body in the earth that's going to teach you other nations how you're supposed to eat, how you're supposed to, how you're supposed to dress, right? 100% garments, things like that, which is in the law. Not eating pork, crab, shrimp, the abominable, the abominable animals of the earth. Y'all going to have to follow suit as well. And we already know y'all claiming y'all customs already that y'all wanna, you know, do y'all own thing and still live with y'all own code of ethics and all that. But the most high gave us a promise that you damn heathens are gonna be under us. Y'all right. are gonna be subjugated to us and all the rules that we have to follow as well. Because the rules that we're got, that's the true way of living in the earth anyway. The most high gave us to the children of Israel because that's the true essence of the earth. What we got for you? You say Israelite? What, 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 what nation are you descend from? Something different than your brother. No, I'm saying, what's your father? Your father is Caucasian? Is your father a Caucasian? No, he's actually father? stolen out of the hospital. You're stolen out of the hospital, so you don't know who you are? Well, from, my, from what I can view, you're a Caucasian, you're a human. I'm not. My you are, brother. Stolen, you can, you can, you, you, you can tell me all that. I'm looking at you in your spirit, man. When is your Edomite, brother? That's why you're on drugs right now. I know, I know who you are. Give me, hold on, hold on. Give me this verse. Hold on, now listen to this real fast before you leave. I know, hey brother, what, what is you though, brother? You black and white. What's your father? Oh yeah, you going to slavery too? Y'all both walking together. Let's get that real fast. You, it's a shame you was born on the opposite end, brother. It's a damn shame. Son. But your father is a devil that makes you a devil. That's right. Right? And, and y'all world is coming to an end. Let's, let's get that. That's right. The book of Second Nessus, chapter 6, verse 8. Come on. And he said unto me, uh -huh. with Abraham unto Isaac, uh -huh. with Jacob and Esau were born to him. That's right. Jacob hand held first the hill of Esau. We held, we held y'all damn hill even coming out the womb. Read verse 9. For Esau is the end of the world. Yeah, we know the end is coming because all you Edomites is looking like damn bones. Y'all right. look like damn homeless people in the streets when y'all in your own damn kingdom. Y'all right. supposed to be ruling right now. Right. Y'all got all the access to the banks, to these different type of loans. Y'all have all the car accesses. Y'all have all these different type of 
say, all these monopolies over the so-called blacks right. and Hispanics. Y'all not losing your, y'all not using your power because your power is dwindling. Right. Every Edomite we see look like he on damn crack, man. Right. So all praise to the Most High God because oh, what he Lord. say about that word, that God. word. For Esau is the end, end of, of the world. world. Esau is the end of the world. That's why these white sure. people looking like they dying, man. Nah. Esau is the beginning of the world and you see us out here teaching the truth boldly because what? And Jacob, because Jacob, which is the 12 tribes of Israel, right. that make up the 12 tribes of Israel, the 12 patriarchs of Jacob, what? Jacob is the beginning of it that follows. So get ready to be captive, to be captives in our kingdom this time. Right, right. To be in our rulership. Get ready for that, man. That's why you see all these white people look like they strung out on damn dope. Right, right. Every last one of them, man. Right. I'm starting to not to see no good white people no more. <laughs> y'all really losing hold of y'all kingdom. Yeah. Let's get a pan on them. Let's do the spirit. Let's pan over. The curse is gonna switch. Yeah. Dude, the Deuteronomy is definitely say that the curse is gonna switch on now. Look at that. Look at that white man, man. Look at the power that he, he no longer have anymore. Look at the kingdom that's coming to an end, man. All praise the most I got your man. Right. Baha Shem, Hamashiach, I was shot. Bring it out. The book of Psalms, chapter 109 and verse 8. Come on. Let his days be few. Come on. And let another take his honor. Let his days be few. Right? Because he was only released for a little while. As long as there have been humans on the earth right. or man dwelling on the earth, Esau only had a small rulership. But the Most High God uses, used him. That's right. right? He's that vessel that the Most High created to be. Give me that in Romans uh, 9. Start at verse 9. I believe it's 19. Right? Because the Most High God, he created that man to be what he is in the earth. Right. And he created the children of Israel to be what they are in the earth, which we are the rulers, the gods, the kings, the priests, the hunters. Right. The, the 12 tribes of Israel make up all of this. Right. We got king, we got kinghood, the, uh, the kingdom, kingship, Salakia. We got priesthood. We got warriors. The northern kingdom possess all warriors. Right. You understand what I'm saying? Judah is full of nothing but kings. Uh, Levi, nothing but priests. You understand what I'm saying? This makes up the 12 tribes of Israel, man. Bring that out for me. Uh, the book of Romans, chapter 9 and verse and verse 21. Uh, have not the father have power over the clay? So the, don't the most high God have power over his creation? Right, read. Have power over the clay of the same lump to make one vessel uh -huh. unto honor. Make one vessel unto honor, which are the children of Israel. These are my honorable, this is my honorable one. But what else? And another unto dishonor. Uh-huh, but another vessel, another lump unto dishonor, which is the so-called white man. Because if you go back to the book of Genesis, right? He said Esau is the sword he created in the earth. So guess what Esau gonna do? Fall on his own damn sword. Right. That's he's that vessel of dishonor, man. More on that. What if the Most High willing to show his wrath and to make his power known? Just like he did to Pharaoh in Egypt. He hardened Pharaoh's heart just so he could show his power in Egypt. That way his name rung bells throughout the whole damn earth after that. That was what he was planning on doing. He's planning to do that as well with Esau. To show his power by just setting up Esau, setting up these thermonuclear plants and all that, the thermonuclear capabilities. He's going to show his power through all the destruction that's about to come on this earth, man. Read. Endure with much long suffering on. the vessels of wrath uh -huh. fitted to destruction. And Esau is just that vessel of wrath that's fitted for destruction. Right. <laughs> right. After a thousand years of serving the children of Israel, Esau is going to be completely wiped out or wiped off the map according to the book of Obadiah. That's right. You understand what I'm saying? And that's what we're hoping for, we're praying for, and we have that faith for it. But enough pressure, you could turn a coal into a diamond. I ain't crying. I used to be blinded, but now I'm conscious. Waking up in bondage, and I know when about yeah, the promise. Up. Now I'm out here in these streets, trying to turn my people from violence. Cause this is gonna be a time where this whole place get demolished.